Hi, I'm Rich with Inside HPC. We're here at SC17 in Denver, Colorado, and this afternoon we're at the Rescale booth, and I am here with Peter. Peter, I understand you have a demo. Can you show me how this works? Definitely. So why are we dive in right away? So uh, we have a platform that allows users to run their simulations very easily without worrying about all the backends. So what a user would do, they will go to our platform, and then they will sign up an account, which is completely free, and they will log into their credential. So they will sign in their credential, and once they log in, uh, they will see a screen like this. So this is the first screen they see. You have a list of jobs you have run in the past and a list of jobs you have currently running. As you can see, I actually have two Boeing 787 simulation running right now. So if a user, say, want to start a new simulation, what they will do is they will click on this new job. And I'm going to say my simulation, you know, very descriptive. And uh, you, know, the, you can see the workflow on the top already. So it's, they provide an input file to the software. They pick which software they want to use. We have 220 software already pre-configured, optimized on the platform. And they can pick which infrastructure hardware they want to run on. And that's all they need to do. So we'll start with the input file. So if they already have the file on the cloud, they can actually go directly to the cloud storage and pick the file from the cloud storage, whatever file they want to use. Uh, you can see I have a list of uh, different files I have available on the platform that I can run. So let's say I want to run this T-junction pipe simulation here, so I can add that to the platform. Uh, I'm also going to add a journal file which drives the simulation. So once I've done that, I'll go ahead and click Next Step, which allows the user to pick whatever simulation they like to use. Uh, now you can see we have all those software titles available on the platform. And uh, in this case, I'm running a fluid flow simulation. So let's go ahead and pick one of the flow uh, software, which is NCS Fluent here. All right, let's go ahead and pick that. So, and the really all you need to do here is that you can see we have different versions available on the platform. So you'll pick the version you like to run, um, as well as you will change the batch command to launch the uh, simulation. So we already pre-populated that with a template. So the user will just go in here and then change the name of the, uh, the uh, file of actual job that I'm running. So not only they can, uh, kind of have hardware on demand, they, for Samsung software, they can also use software on demand, which we offer the on-demand license. Uh, if they already have a license, they can actually use their existing license and connect to our platform. So the next step, which is picking the hardware, and this is really where Rescale already shine, that we provide a complete list of infrastructure, they can always pick the best hardware for the simulation they're running. So if you're running a CFD simulation, you might want a faster interconnect, you want a higher clock speed. If you're running a finite element analysis, you may want a higher RAM on your simulation. So in this case, let's say we're going to use this Onyx core type. And down below, they can easily choose how many core they want to use. So you can see 1, 4, 8, 18. Uh, there's no upper limit. And the nice thing running in the cloud is there no code type. So it's going to job will start right away. So once I've done that, uh, we can go ahead and click Submit. And that's pretty much it. So three steps, input file, software, power, your job will be running right away. And it takes a few steps to provision a cluster. So it starts with the valid input, and then it will provision a cluster, and your job will be running right away. So now while we're waiting for that to provision, so let's look at one of the jobs that I started earlier. So as you can see, uh, this is a job that started 10 minutes earlier. It has been running for 11 minutes now. And uh, the starting cluster takes three minutes. And you have the screen where you can monitor the job progress. So for example, you can look at the, you know, the streamline of the, the, this Boeing 787 simulation to look at it, you know, whether it's converging well enough. You can monitor progress as you go. So hopefully that gave you a kind of a high level overview how to run a platform. Uh, one thing I do want to point out is that we also offer remote desktop to allow user to visualize their data without actually downloading data back to their local computer. So what they do, will do is to go to our desktop tab and spin up one of the virtual desktop that's running on the cloud and load up the data they like to see. So for example here, we can actually connect directly to the remote desktop in your browser. So you don't need to have any software installed. Uh, in this case, I have a crash analysis loaded. So why don't we take a look here? There we go. So you can actually load up this data and look at it. Maybe all you really need is an animation of this movie, and you can actually download that to the cloud. So hopefully that gives you a kind of overview how to run a simple simulation on Rescale very, very easily, just a few clicks. Yeah, well, hey, thanks for that demo. That's very slick. And I look uh, really forward to seeing more from Rescale. Thanks again. Definitely. Thank you for having us.